that run in my head and the loss of my child brought me to Leslie. And so once again, I'm so blessed because by reaching out to her, I now have promise and hope that maybe someone else's child won't do what my child did. Law enforcement folks came to my house the night that I was suicidal, gun in my mouth in front of my wife. Those are the times when things are the hardest. People are embarrassed, they've lost hope. That's where I was. Those guys and the way they treated me for a few short minutes on a very bad night put me on the trajectory to have me up here on this stage talking to you today. Thank God that there's places and people and organizations like this foundation. Because without you and everyone in here, there'd be a lot of hurting going on. And we need to make that difference. But I had this amazing opportunity right in front of me, and all I had to do was say yes. It was one of the best things that I've ever said yes to still to this day, other than marrying my wife. What you guys do day in, day out, we're sleeping in our beds, I'm cuddling my grandchildren. Um, my safety, my protection depends on all of you. You go out in the nights, you go out in the mornings, you go out on holidays with no concern for yourself. And this foundation is going to make sure that we can do anything we can to help support you.